That didn't do anything for our hunger. Oh! There they are. Hi guys, I'm Raging Diesel, and welcome to another hardcore episode of The Infected. Now in our last episode, we went upstairs and started working on our craft room. Now we rearranged the tables and got the lights up to working all except for one more, which because we were short on electrical parts. We also placed a desk and we still need more electrical parts for the computer there. And we also set some blueprints down for the bedroom and the living area. Now, we need about 25 more electrical parts, is what I'm thinking. 25 to 30 more electrical parts before we're finished. And I figure we'll either go on the live stream or in the next episode. Also, during the last episode, we got a horde night on the last minute. I mean, I was literally ready to quit the game and it ended up showing up right before we finished. So now with the slaughterhouse complete and we're working on other things, I think we'll go ahead and since it's kind of early, kind of late in the day to get started, we're going to go ahead and work on things around the base here first and then go ahead and do some more uh, do some fishing and get that uh, fish oil that we need for, for the lamps. Now, I know we're going to need lamps as well for a bunch of things, but let's go ahead and uh, take care of our animals and get some biofuel. It's crazy. Uh... I also went in between episodes and I went and grabbed some more oil shale out of the two uh, two extractors this way. Not these ones over here. Not these three over here, but the ones over here. And even with the Horde Knight, we ended up getting a couple pieces of steel and a piece of aluminum, but not a single electrical part. So we're definitely going to have to go and get some. I was hoping during the Horde Night we would get one, but we didn't. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to check on things here. And it looks like we're out of repair kits. So we'll make sure we get those taken care of as well today. Um... We have some biofuel, but we need to take care of our animals. I want to check, see what's in here. All right, we're going to first off, we'll go ahead, move this over. We'll go make sure the animals are fed. That's good enough. Get ourselves a little bit to eat. And now that this is empty, we can go ahead and do our biofuel. This is 
We got so much. And I'm thinking also we might as well go ahead and make placeables uh, others. There, the garbage. That takes 20 iron ingots. We'll take care of that sometime today. And grab all this biofuel. That's just a ton. That should be enough almost to, to last us the rest of the time we're here. And we're going to run over here, throw this into the, the clay extractors. Of course, this needs some. I don't know how much more this clay will need, but we'll go ahead and keep it running. And our stones are all full. So we're good with that. I also moved all the log stands back over here. Because we're not doing any more building. So we can leave those there. And we'll put our biofuel away over here. got so much now we should probably last us to the for the rest of the time here we're gonna go ahead and make sure these are all topped off I wanted to check something as we make this is that see find out if they keep stacking over the, the 25 for a while and we'll add the surplus in here That's good. Put this log cart back out. Keep our eyes open again for more sheep. Definitely going to need that. Looks like Mike needs a place to put those. I got to get that my water back. All right, those are good. Looks like he found a place for all the logs. Because he's picked them up. And they're now gone. All right. Wherever you put them, Mike. I don't see him. I'll end up finding a log stand somewhere. Because he's out there working on, on the... Oh, we got a bear. Do we have a bear for our thing? No, we don't. Let's, uh, let's 
let's go ahead and take care of him. Got a bear and a deer. What a shot. Another animal to our collection. Maybe if we have time today, we can go get the croc skins. Oh, uh, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and put him up. On here now. Put this back where it belongs, close the gate, and I want to make sure the gate up front's closed. So let's run around here. I want to make sure this gate was closed. I can't remember if I closed it or not during that um, horde night where we ended up with so many... We ended up with so many of those van... Uh, Bambi... Bambi's here. We had probably nine or ten. No, uh, we don't need you right now. But I will be getting food here in a second. I wanted to check in here. Make sure everything's here's empty. Because when we go out looking for electrical parts, I figure we'll stop by the copper mine. Probably get more copper. I want to make sure this is all clear. That's good. I don't know if we're going to need those anymore. I think that's all we will need for the truck. So why don't we work on putting these away. And we got a place for them upstairs in the storage room. I decide to put things away in the storage room we will so every time we walk by there we'll take care of it uh, we got some seeds to put away looks like we got some spare bandages some nails feathers Everything else goes down below. Couple steel fragments. An aluminum ingot. And a steel ingot. For that, we're good. These are extras. I want to put one of these over here. In case I need to move sand to make glass. At least I'll have it available. Looks like these are full. So now's the perfect time. Uh, we'll go ahead and hit H. Take the fragments. Move them all. Anytime we need extra sand, we know where to find it. And those aren't completely full. Go ahead and just hit control, right click, put them in there. There, and what, since we need the ingots, we'll hit H on this and get that started again. Take these 200. And we'll move this over here. And we'll go ahead and get this started. Those 
two copper out. We got some extra fragments here. We'll just throw them up in here just now and put the two copper away. And we have the bait. I'm going to get some extra. I think it's over in here. I think 35 bait should be enough. Where's our friend at? There it is. This is we're guided by the hip by this cart. It helps us with everything. Got to go get our fishing pole, but luckily we have an extra one right here. So we'll just move this here. Grab this fishing pole. And let's go do some fishing now that the sun's out and we got time. We'll run out here and we'll have space to grab an animal if we need to. Not just now. I um, prefer to grab a sheep if I can. We're going to need all the extra wool that we need. Looks like there's plenty of deer, but no sheep. Remember during the live stream, there was like three all in one spot. Okay, well, I've got, I've got bait. Hopefully, we won't get snuck up on. Let's grab our fishing pole. Well, we did it first try. I don't know why we missed that. Okay, I'm using the, I must be hitting the wrong button. You make sure you hit the right mouse button. There's the first one. We'll go ahead and fill up this and then transfer them over. Now, one thing you can do, if you want to, if you're going to make fish oil and you want to make a whole bunch of it, you could go ahead and harvest these as well and just bake the fish and put them in, put them in your food bag when you're getting ready. Looks like I'm out of water. Hold on. Let's see. Oh, we're going to have to go back. I forgot to get my water and we should go ahead and put our our hat on and what I'm thinking that might be a perfect place for us to use this overhang to keep out of the sun. So first off, we'll go ahead and we'll switch out our hat. 
we'll b make sure we switch back beforehand. Um, go grab the water. Oh. Our fragments should be done. Oh, and I can't turn them off. Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna put these in here. There, that's done. Grab our water. Do we have a drink? Just barely enough to last. Now, we're out of water. Now, you can just fill this up. And why don't we just do this just now? We might get some more rain. We just got some rain before, so I don't understand that. But we're gonna take this with us and use this as like a sunshade for our fishing, so we're not gonna worry about getting sunburn. And if we leave it in the water, I think the Vambies won't touch it until winter time, which shouldn't be a problem. Okay, you can't put it completely in the water. But we can stand in the shade now. And should be able to get, get our... Our fish this way. We'll just keep catching the fish as we can. And once we have a full complement, we'll be all right. And we should be able to get as much fish oil as we need to. Cloudy day, but it's not really sunny. But at least we don't have to worry about our sun exposure and getting sunburned now that we've got this overhand. Yeah, we'll never get any well, tuna out of here. You can only get it on the coastline. And that's one of the things I want to do maybe for season five is maybe get a build somewhere close to the coast. So we have a large complement of tuna, which is the better complement when it comes to do it, dealing with fish. Okay, couple trout, couple tuna, I mean, couple bluegill. We'll just keep going until we get a full amount. I know this is going to take a little bit of time, but I'll try to edit. I'm going to try to edit it as best I can to make it look interesting.
I'm not too worried about an attack because the music should come in. And we should hear that before we get attacked from behind. But we might have a wandering Bambi. So we should keep our eyes open. So far, nothing. Maybe we're close enough to the base. Hello. In case we get another one, we'll go ahead and put these in here. Start these off in here. And continue fishing. And we'll just keep going until we run out of bait. Or we fill up our bags. Here, here's the rain. You can fish in the rain, I guess. But we're going to need... But we're going to need a lot of fish oil because I'm going to, we're going to be using a lot of them them oil lamps. Oh, look at 165 day 165 in the infected. That's crazy. That's a what? What? That's close to half a year. I know we've been we've been playing this this season quite long, and it took a lot longer than I thought we were gonna do. Next season won't be as long because we won't have as much um a much to accomplish. But it'll still be fun, and we'll have another good build to do. It just won't be as elaborate. I'm going to try to keep it relatively simple. That's right, I tried to do this time, and I really overdid it. But the hardest part was not actually that, because we took a... We took a lot of time having to get get started with this, getting health kits, getting resources, getting fuel so we could travel more, and then getting our foundations built so we could actually do it. And we did the first 50, 50 or so episodes without any cuts and without me doing anything in between. I did the whole thing with you. So this kind of saves time. And I don't think I'll do that again. I'll do a lot more preparing pre episodes to get things done so we could get, get the season done within like 60 episodes, is what I was hoping for. We should easily do that since we're doing it live and each episode, each live episode will be at least two hours, if not a little longer.
All right, let's take a look. Well, we're running. We're running low on space. We might be able to get a couple more fish in there. Especially if they're tuna. I mean, not tuna, but trout. Those panfish, you don't get a lot out of them for how much space they take up. Looks like we could use a bite to eat, and we have nothing to eat. We got two more baits, so we'll we'll use the two baits and we'll call it for the fishing trip. That's another bluegill. All right, that's the last of the bait. Let's head on back. Hello, chicken. I'm gonna run out of... I'm gonna grab these. That prop. That didn't do anything for our hunger. Oh! Put this over here just now. There they are. Screws. Come on, electronics. Electronic parts. Steel. <laughs> okay. Now, I think we're going to need some glass. So, what I'm thinking is we'll go ahead and make up some. And while we're doing that, we'll harvest this fish. But we're going to take a few of these. I think we'll take... Let's take... Uh, yeah, let's take three of these trout and stick them on the drying rack. That way we'll have some dried fish. Okay, we got three fish drying. Let's grab some of this.
And we're pretty full. That should do us for the rest of the day. Let's get some sand. Just take that sand. And we'll make up some glass. Oh my gosh, these things are left running. Wasted so much coal. Uh, put these fragments in here. That should be enough sand. And we've got fragments in there. My goodness, this is going to take us forever. Steel. Iron. Let's dump these seeds in here just now. Oh, not the fish. Heck, that glass is already ready. Glass. And let's put this out. And we'll come back with that. While that's cooking, we'll go ahead and harvest this fish. I'm going to put this in here just now and grab that, grab all that, just harvest it up. Then we got fish. There's 10. We got the sticks behind us now. We're going to make some of it into cooked fish. Okay, let's grab some more. That should be all we'll need. Ten pieces to harvest. Looks like the fish is ready. Let's go ahead a couple pieces. That did real good. 
All right, now we got a bunch of fish. So to make fish oil, I think it's under here. No, it's on the bottom. On the workbench. Looks like we just got in time to finish out the day. So we craft one glass, one fish, and we got fish oil everywhere. Just don't have the space for it all. Um, let's go grab our cart. Should be 20 total. Maybe it was more. Put these back. glass this away I think we can move the fragments the glass away I think we got plenty of fish oil now nothing went outside so we I guess that's what we had six times I guess I don't know I really don't know. Let's move this in here. We're gonna... There's the fish oil. We still need four iron ingots and two copper. So, eight iron, four copper. That's that. To complete that, we could upgrade it with bricks. So we'll take our fishing pole, swap it back for our upgrade tool. Let's grab some dry bricks. And just brick up these half walls. Let's do the dark. There. Now, if we wanted to, we could cement up the poles. Let me know what you want, whether you'd rather have it cemented up or not. And let me know in the comments. I'm thinking about just this whole, just this area right here from this part back. We may be cementing this part up just to upgrade it a little. But we'll be doing that in a future episode. So we got that part done. Um, still didn't get any more electrical parts, so we're not moving forward on that any. Did I drop this here? Could use that. Okay. 
Drop that here. Where did I put my water at? Oh, it's still here. Okay. We're all good with that oil. And usables, furniture, lighting. Maybe just one on the top of each one of these stairs. I don't know if we'll put that light in there or not. Just one of these here. Also, we got another thing to put in here I want. Is I want to put a fireplace. Placeables, furniture... I'm looking for the fireplace. The core. Maybe it's under here. Coffee machine. Heck. I thought we had a fireplace. No. So let's look under here. Let's go under construction, others. see him. I don't know where it went. I thought we had something here. I need a place to put this TV. Placeables. Furniture. Here's something new. Uh, living room. I didn't even notice this TV. Or is it under decor? Is that TV? Placeables decor. There's the TV. It looks like it's going to have to go on a table. We'll finish that. Hmm. Right, we got two more here, one here. I think we got enough. Go ahead and make up some more. So 
like the lights are out here. Light this place up a little bit since I'm not wearing my helmet. I grab that copper. That's one. It actually kind of looks good. I thought we had fireplaces. Maybe I'm missing something, but I can't seem to find it anywhere. Walls, ceilings, roofs, stairs, others. No, it's not here. Placeables. It's not under workbenches, not under storage. It's not under power or plumbing. Not under bedroom furniture, kitchen furniture. No, no fireplace there. Nothing there. Living room. We got chairs, stools. wood cabinet, even a, a filing cabinet, but nothing under, that's living room, there's nothing under dining room, nothing under lighting, let's go under decor, there's no fireplaces anymore, what happened to the fireplaces? Crazy. All right. Well, I know at the end of season three, we had them. They built them because I put one in. And at this season finale, I'll definitely show you. Kind of lights this place up pretty well. I don't know if I'm going to work this this way or not, whether or not we put a TV up or what, but we'll, we'll figure it out. We also had braziers. I'm missing something somewhere because I remember seeing them. They were wood braziers, heaters. Here we go. What's this? There's a brazier here. That's one fireplace. Where's the other one? Brick forge. There it is. They're right here. Was that under others? It was under others. And that takes what? 10 iron, 25 screws, and 25 cement. I'll wait for time. Let's see if I have any more screws up here. Do, but not enough. Twenty five cement. What do you say, guys?
a little heavy. Come back for those once we make that fireplace. Let's grab... Come back. The glass away. There we go. We have a nice little fire in here. Looks nice. What do we got for the bed? 12 planks, 20 cloth, 20 nails, 3 copper. Oh my gosh. See how much copper we're using. We definitely need to go. See, we used all of it. planks okay so we need 20 cloth and 20 nails I think Where's this going? That is going from here. This has got to move down, I guess. And so does this one. Now you won't see that wire. Well, you're still seeing it. Wow. Ah, uh, we'll get back to that. All right. Looks like we need seven more cloth. While we're here, let's see, that's basically as low as it's going to go. Oh, it's this one. That fiber and bark. Make up as much as we can. really wasn't a lot. We're going to have to start chopping our own logs down just to get bark chips and stuff. We might do that over at the mines. Clear them out. What's that doing there? Where did the cloth go? Oh, did it... I think I put it in the bed already. There.
Right. Well, it's already four. We're going to go ahead and go to bed in our new bed. Get up in the morning. How are we for time? Well, we're just about out of time for today. We got some accomplished. We got a few things built. We got our fish oil. So we should have plenty of that. Now, uh, leave that bait here. I know where our fish oil is, and I know we got two boxes down below that we can just grab back again. Put this in. Since that's complete, now that we got this parked, where is. Oh my goodness. We'll just go around. Now it's blocked. Now it's all covered. Back in the cart. And we're good. So that's all the time we have for today. And now I'll take the some uh, time in between episodes to sort things out. I'm going to start adding some materials to some of those uh, pieces available. That way we know what we're missing, what we need to make. And the next morning, day 167, we'll head out on another adventure to try to get some more electrical parts. Let's get ourselves a drink here. Now we're good to go. So. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe for future content. Don't forget to ring the bell and comment down below. You know, I love your comments. They give me great feedback and they help the channel grow. So until next time, this is Raging Diesel saying, keep the shiny side up. Goodbye, everybody.